hi everyone welcome back to my kitchen so today i'll be making green banana porridge join me in my kitchen today it's my first time making this porridge i'm sure i am going to enjoy it and i'm sure you are going to also try if you haven't done it before now i'm going to be using the grater to grate the bananas today now i've no blender yeah so i'm going to be using the grater today Okay, so in order to get, since I'm not using a blender today, in order to get the banana real smooth, I will be using the smallest side of the grater to grate the banana. Don't watch me, guys. <laughs> I'm always afraid of a grater. We Jamaicans know how a grater can do our fingers. Yes, so now I have finished gratering the banana. I sure didn't like this part of it. When next I try this recipe, I will make sure I am using my blender. I sure didn't enjoy this grater in part. Okay, but the blender will give it a smoother texture. Okay. Let's see what my porridge will be like. Okay, so now I'll be adding the banana. So boiling water. Let's just have a look. Okay, so on the low flame, I'll have this continue to boil. As I said before, a blender would have given the bananas, and I used four bananas, the blender would have given it a smoother texture. And guys, my bananas were kind of <laughs> started to ripe. I'll definitely be using a blender the next time. Okay, so I'm trying to crush the pieces of banana as I go along, but it's it's coming on, getting creamier, and as I go along, I add a little warm water. My first time making green banana porridge, can't wait to taste it. Okay, so now I'm going to be adding some salt and as they say, we shake until we hear our ancestors say, stop. So that's some salt, some nutmeg powder. Oh, no, this one is a cinnamon powder <laughs> and now some nutmeg powder. Blend in the cinnamon and the nutmeg. And my ancestors say to add a little bit more cinnamon powder. And a little bit more nutmeg. And let's stir again. Yeah, my green banana porridge. 
still trying to get it to a perfect consistency not yet the important thing is to make sure that it's cooked doesn't have to be smooth most important thing is that it's cooked now to sweeten I'll be adding condensed milk guys I haven't used condensed milk in ages but I'm using it today for my porridge you can choose whatever sweetener you want to use I guess you can use cow's milk with a little sugar you can always sweeten to your taste ah, I think I'm liking the look of it now mm, yum 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 Ah, it's now creamy. I'm trying to get off this slice at the top. Yum, yum, yum. I can't wait to taste. Simple breakfast. Green banana porridge. So I let this sit for another two minutes and then I remove from the flame. And there you have it guys, my green banana porridge. Now if you like this video, I want you to like, share and subscribe. And please leave a comment in the comment section. And make sure to turn on your notification bells so you can know when I put out a new video. Thanks for watching, guys. Mwah.